My name is Marie Burr and I'm a clinician scientist and a pathologist and I work in cancer research, trying to understand better ways we can use the immune system to target cancer. There's huge interest across the world in tumor immunotherapy and really the huge potential that this has as a way of treating cancer. Some people are focusing very much on looking at the immune cells and how that we can improve the function of the immune cells to target the tumor. The aim of my research is to find out why some cancers don't respond well to these kind of therapies and to understand other ways in which we may be able to improve the targeting of those cancers. We're particularly focused on looking at T cells of the immune system, which can specifically target and kill cancer cells. However, once the cancer cells have found a way to hide, then it can become very difficult for the T cells to seek them out and find the tumour. And that's essentially what we want to do, is to try and make the tumour cells more visible to the T cells so that they're able to target and then kill them. Marion's research is at the cutting edge of the host response to disease. That is, the human body's response to cancer in particular, but also to infection, to injury and to ageing. This is the next frontier of understanding disease processes and in designing tailored, personalised and precision treatments. ANU has had a long and proud history of being one of the best medical research schools in Australia. Bringing Marion Bird to ANU ensures that cancer research is one of the best in Australia and indeed one of the best in the world. We are making an eight-year commitment to researchers because we want them to take a bold vision. We want them to take real risks in their research so that actually we can really change the research environment in their fields. Ultimately, this is something that we're going to be able to use to treat all different types of cancer. At the moment, there are specific cancers that have responded very well, so cancers like melanoma and certain types of lung cancer. These are tumours that are common, they affect lots of people, um, but also the many other different types of cancer that maybe so far haven't responded as well. That's where we hope that we'll also be able to make a big difference. 